My name is William Blake, and I'm a painter. In the Civil War, the American genre of art was the Hudson River School, the Great Landscapes. When we had the Civil War and had these kind of big battles, it was kind of this unknown territory of, of how artists, American artists, were going to depict that. And I think artists like Winslow Homer, they kind of steered away from these grand Messonnier kind of grand history paintings. It becomes a very insular, quiet painting of a sharpshooter or a soldier meditating by a grave. That sort of American tradition has kind of influenced how I paint war in a way. And also, most of my paintings don't have many weaponry. There's not many. It's kind of the meditation as opposed to a, an action. I am a reenactor. I portray artist correspondence during the Civil War. So in the painting for the Lincoln Legacy program is of Hugh Goffinette, who I knew via Civil War reenacting. But he also portrays Abraham Lincoln Brigade. So this is the Americans who left the U.S. to go fight in Spain in the 1930s, late 1930s. I thought it was interesting and a kind of a nice connection to Lincoln. They themselves thought they were fighting white supremacy, fascism. They had no avenue to fight white supremacy in the United States so when they had the opportunity to do it abroad and fight the soldiers that were Mussolini's men and Hitler's men and then Franco's. Uh, they did that. Hugh kind of takes on that and tells that story. You know, I put him in the pose of Lincoln's presidential portrait that George Healy painted. So kind of reinforcing these iterations and legacies. The work is really all about seeing the present and the past. And you know, while I was doing this project, you know, there's these sort of rhymings of the Spanish Civil War, the right taking over, an election. And then right now, there's an international brigade in Ukraine fighting a, what they see as a fascist uh, dictator. So there's a, very, there's a lot of similarities within this. So even though I'm painting the past, it's always kind of a, about the present. Even, you know, painting the past is kind of disingenuous because everybody in the paintings are people I know, they're reenactors. I don't paint them as other people, I'm painting them as they portray other people. So there's kind of that layering of it's all now. So it's not really about Lincoln, it's about how we perceive him and how we see him. And I think that the Lincoln Brigade was a huge part of his legacy and how we perceive him as the, the commander in chief, the fighter of white supremacy um, by those who fought white supremacy.